In question 24, we have a question on forces, and um, what happens is um, a block with a spring attached. Um, when we place a magnet beneath it, and it starts to um, the length of the spring actually starts to shorten. So um, what has happened is, um, of course, um, there must be another additional force from the magnet uh, causing the um, block M to actually um, move upwards. So uh, this must be a magnetic repulsion force. So we can actually see that block M is a magnet. And uh, let's take a look at the question. We're trying to see which of the following forces are acting on spring L, not the block M. Uh. So in this case, uh, there is no frictional force acting on block uh, the spring L. There's no magnetic force acting on spring L because it is acting on block M, not the spring L. So in this case, there is gravitational force, there is elastic spring force, so answer will be number 4.